here we go, intern. <gasps> Look, babies! Oh, two new little itty bitties, huh, guys? That's pretty interesting that she came all the way over here to give birth right at the feet of one of the giant ground sloths. Oh, hey, and one of our guests saw that happen. Guess what do you think? What are your thoughts? Yeah, she did just have a baby. Isn't that so cool? I have no clue how to pronounce your name, so we're just going to call this little buddy. We'll call this little buddy after you. We'll call it Kim. There you go. After the guest who saw them give birth. As usual, intern, if you have baby names, leave them in my desk. Little note, just scribble them down. Stick them on my desk. I'll get to them in just a bit. Good. So it seems like the meerkats are doing just fine. Look at those giant ground sloths, man. Are you nice and relaxed? Whoops. Ah! There we go. Are you snoozy? Do you need a nap? Do you like your tree? I can get you more trees. I'm big on trees. Oh, short-faced bird dislikes being in such a smelly exhibit. Goodness, there is a lot of poop going around here. Don't worry, guys. I'm on it. Hang on, hang on. Oh, don't look at me like that. Oh, goodness. That was a little bit threatening. Ah, but good morning, intern. Just the usual. Running around, cleaning up poop. Getting ready for our grand plans. Look at that snow. That's so cool. I really wonder what happened to our caveman. Wah! Easy there, sir. I can get out of your way. Jeez. Hmm. We'll have to find him. I'm sure he's somewhere in the zoo. What is a caveman who's been frozen for who knows how long in a glacier I'm gonna know about living in the modern world? Obviously, he needs to be put in his own happy little habitat, and we'll take care of him from there. We'll debate the ethics of it later. Alright. Everybody's doing good over here? No? Not good? Thirsty? If you're thirsty and you know what, please drink from the bin. There you go. That should do it. Hmm. Good. That looks somewhat decent. Our Tyrannosaurus Rexes are doing good. Alright, and turn back to our major project. Ah, <sighs> Getting the Cliffside Cafe finished. Oh, I'm so excited about this. I really think this is going to be one of the highlights of our zoo. Alright, now let's just grab... Grab our bridge. Mm-hmm. And we're going to extend it, I think, yeah, we're going to extend it over here, maybe? Maybe over here, yeah. And then just kind of do a little open area. Have to think about how big we want it. For the gazebos, because this is going to be like the gazebo viewpoint. Where people can come over, stand in gazebos. Kind of get an up close and personal view. Way out here. Oh, look, there's a nest. That's fantastic. And an unhappy dino. Why are you unhappy? Hmm? Okay, it's sleeping. I think it'll be okay. Goodness. The zoo is always so busy. You get back, back here after a night off, and you're just running around like a chicken with your head cut off trying to keep up with everything. I think. Yeah, this will be good, I think. A little three by three. 4x4, four 4x3. Four, four yeah, that doesn't look too bad. No, gotta alter it a little bit. Maybe make it a little bigger. It's not symmetrical, and that's very important in turn. You'll learn about these things in the future. Maybe extend it one more. Can I at least, like, make this symmetrical? Oh, there we go. That's much better. That's what we needed. Alright, don't be afraid. I know it's really high up, but we can get these planks hammered in. If we work together, you know? Almost there. Okay, now cautiously. Carefully. Good. Sometimes you just have to... There, much better. Much more symmetrical. That'll do, that'll do. Hmm... The Phoenix box has just given birth. We'll have to check on that in just a second. Now, let's make sure that we don't have too many of these blocking the animal's ability to get around. Good there. Let's see. 
course we can't take too many of them out or else we'll have some issues with the structural integrity of our bridge. But there we go. Alright! That's fantastic! And check those guys out. Hi guys! I hope you enjoy the view! The sky tram's really been extended. It's gotten quite popular. Alright. Let's see. Next up, I think, would be putting the actual cafe in. Or actually, next up is making sure that it can connect down to this pathway. We want to have everything hooked up so that people can make easy access. There we go. Put you here, and you here. Alright, and then, what's it gonna- uh-oh. Uh-oh. Terrence! Terrence the third, this is unnecessary behavior. Don't you dare get in there. I know how badly you want to eat those dodos. Oh, fudge. Come back. Come back. No! We cannot have a raging Tyrannosaurus Rex. Oh, he's really mad. You know, I'm thinking it might be time to invest in a professional dino capture team. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This is just a dangerous job, especially now that we have the Tyrannosaurus Rexes. It's okay, it's okay. Gotcha. Whew. Of course, I do like taking such a personal investment in making sure that all the animals in our zoo are well taken care of. Little guy, Matilda the second, get down. Stay down there. Then you guys would be much happier. Terrence the second, keep your, your child in line. Okay? Keep him in line. I wonder how much longer Ripper is going to be here with us. She's an awesome old dino. Oh, I guess you guys heard about when she got loose the other day, huh? It, it was a big accident, and there were a lot of heads that rolled. But thankfully, everyone was very understanding, and everything worked out just fine. Let's see, let's scoot that over. Grab you. Hmm. And, mm, put you there for now. Alright, intern, by the time you leave here, you're going to be an expert on building bridges. Not many people can say that. Man, those meerkats don't live very long. I'm glad we had them while we, we did, and that we've got enough that they can pretty much breed to sustain themselves. Alright, let's clear that out. Can we move you? I don't think we can move you, but we'll just... We'll see if we can leave that there. Alright, a little bit further. Just a bit. Right there. And... Yes! This'll do it. Alright. Good. Let's grab this. We're getting rave reviews from all of our guests, though, and that's really good. That's part of what this zoo is all about. Because if the guests are enjoying the zoo, then hopefully they'll donate, and hopefully they'll go home more educated about the animals in this world. Alright, good. That's down. Let's see. How close can we get it? The fencing part is always so tricky. I'm gonna have to clear those out, unfortunately. I love the trees, but sometimes there's just not enough room. Alright, come here, you. Nope. So that's too close. But still too close, too close. Ah, just right. Good, come on, you can do it. Alright, there we go, intern. Looks like we will have to move the cave, though. It's just not... Oh, wait. Oh, we did it! We didn't have to destroy their cave. That's always a positive. There we go. Alright! Just a second, let's make sure we put down... Right, right kind of sod down there. Good. Cautiously. There we go. Alright, let's look at this. Oh, check this out. Look at that. Look at this amazing bridge. Oh, that's just wonderful. Guess we'll be able to climb in here, get up close, get a really good view of all the animals. Oh, it's just, it's perfect. It's just awesome. 
Of course, it's not just going to be these animals that attract them either. Whew. It's almost time to add our big guy into the zoo. Let's just get our cat poop cafe, fancy pants cliffside cat poop cafe established. Let's see. Yep, it's going to be this one. We did get building permits for it after all, so we can put it in. Then, come on. Hmm. Hmm. The symmetrical issue comes back to haunt us. I think it'll be okay though. If we do that, and then block it off so people aren't silly and decide to try to jump in. Hmm. Oh man, that symmetrical issue is going to drive me mad. Alright, we're going to have to do something about it. That's okay, entering, because think long term. These are the steps that we have to take in order to make this zoo last in the long run. We're not going to be here much longer, after all. Everybody is just about ready and able to take care of themselves. Though, obviously, the zookeepers... Oh my gosh, are you for real? Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Obviously, the zookeepers are going to need to have regular training classes on how to scoop poop, because they are just, they just cannot seem to manage it, I am telling you. Oh, without us, what are they going to do? Well, they're going to just have to keep going to their courses. Before we leave, we can, like, put down some notes about who's the worst of it. There. Oh, that's much better. We've put so much work into this, we want to make sure that it has a good, like, up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Ripper, darling, get down. I swear. Let's just get out the shovel and try to, try to, like, come on. Fix this issue even more. Hopefully that'll help. Whew, there. Alright, so there's the cafe. Let's decorate it with uh, some boreal trees, I think. If we can get any up here. Might not be able to. That's okay, we might just have to settle with the magnificent view. And a bunch of flowers. Yep, looks like the magnificent view and the flowers are going to have to do it. Dun dun dun! Oh, that looks awesome! Oh, that is just fantastic. Don't worry, we'll convince people to come up here. Somehow. We'll manage to get them to wiggle up this way once we have some really cool new five-star animals to check out down here. Alright, now let's make sure we get our gazebo view put in. Doo -doo 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 -doo. All right. There it is. There's the plans for it. Oh! Hmm! Well, this isn't going to provide as much room as I thought it would, but that's okay. Alright. Whoops. Hmm. Actually, that, that didn't go down. It has to be perfect, in turn. Patience. Hmm. Looks like that's the only way we can get it to go in the way we want. That is fine. Perfectly fine. Alright, let's see. What else is it? What? Lighthouse can see remember that. Um, yeah, and then we can be really fancy. Stick a few fountains up here, because why the heck not? I don't know. Why not? Let's see, anything else? Anything else? So we can really feel like uh, we've got this decked out alright. Why don't, why don't you tell me in turn? I don't know about the fountain, actually. That seems kind of silly. <laughs> I would rather, like, have a flower or something there. That, that is a little excessive, but that's okay. Alright, intern, since we've both invested so much time in this project, why don't you tell me what you think we should have up here? Besides, I'm going to put down a couple benches for people to rest, and then let's see. Just a couple more, because it is a big slope. People tend to get exhausted when they have to climb up super big slopes like this. Hmm, I wonder if we should try to, like, sneak in a candy or, like, a 
ice cream cart or something. Maybe we can sneak an ice cream cart up here. Ooh, maybe we can sneak a gift cart up here. Yeah, let's try that. See what happens. There we go. Because people will be happy and well fed. They can come out and buy a gift. We'll see how that works. Alright, but I'm going to leave the rest of it other than a couple telescopes. Because these are going to be super important to let people see what's going on. Mm hmm. Whoops. Nope, 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 nope. We don't want to throw the binoculars down there. That'd be silly. There we go. Put, whoops. Put one right there. Ah, oh, this would be perfect! Yeah, we'll put a couple down here. Good. That's a good start. That's a good start. And now... Oh, look at that. Oh, this is beautiful. This is really good. Now to put the cream on top of all of this. <sighs> By going and digging out the DNA of one of the last animals that we have yet to add to our zoo intern. Alright, I know, I know, it's probably in here. Pretty sure that you and I put this together, but I could be wrong. Let's check the fossil boxes. There it is. American Mastodon. Oh, wow. Oh, man, can you imagine what it's going to be like to have the mastodons roaming in there? They're boreal, so they can go in with our triceratops. I just hope they play along well. This large, shaggy mammal may have enjoyed spending times in lakes and swamps. Ooh. Wow, its coat could grow up to 7 inches, or 18 centimeters long. Man. <sighs> this is going to be cool. Let's get in here. Whoop! Lots of pieces. This might take just a minute. But that is okay. I'm pretty sure we know where those go, the tusks. This looks like a bit of the skull in turn. So very carefully. You and I have put a lot of these together, and this is one of the very last pieces. That's really hard to wrap your mind around a little bit, isn't it? But that's okay, because we've worked hard. Hmm. That actually might be a femur. Let's switch that out of the way. That's definitely some ribs. Tools? Tail? What is this? I think it's part of a tail. Gonna have to see. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Let's make sure we have a bunch of them. Yep. This is definitely a jigsaw. So in turn, I, I think I can announce it. It's finally official. One of the places that I'm getting ready to move on to after you and I complete this zoo together is going to work for an aquarium. That is pretty fun. There's two zoos actually that I'm going to be spending my time between. One of which is an aquarium. Uh, and the other of which is going to be a very large public zoo for public education that I'm actually going to be working with another zookeeper in. I'm pretty excited about that. Hopefully, you know, he and I won't step on each other's toes too much. I hear we're both a little bit of control freaks in our own ways, so it'll be interesting to see if we butt heads quite literally while trying to take care of the zoo. I mean, as long as he doesn't mess with my trees, everything should be fine. I'm not too worried. But if he messes with my trees, it's war. Just letting you know now. It's gonna be war. Alright, let's see. Hmm. Almost there. Is everything going on okay? Can you check my text messages? Uh, oh, Katie! Oh, fudge. We have to finish this and get to Katie. I really need to just assign someone to take care of her exclusively. I swear, I don't know why everyone's so afraid of her. It's not like Katie's aggressive or anything. She's been a sweetheart. What the heck is that? Looks like a femur? That's kind of the go-to guess when you're having trouble with the bones in turn. Is it a femur? Oh, there we go. There, now things are starting to look better. Sometimes you just have to take a minute away from staring and staring and staring at what you're trying to do. There we go. Alright, yeah, things are starting to come together now. 
Ooh, more donations from a new birth. This zoo is hopping. It has just gotten so busy. And we're pretty much a perma 5 star now, have you noticed? That's just wonderful. I'm so glad we were able to meet some of our goals. Uh, which reminds me, intern, do you have any more goals that you want to work on with me? You gotta speak up now or forever hold your peace, you know. Ah, oh, there we go, they were teeth. I see it now. Pretty soon we're gonna move on to other projects. Let me know what projects you want to work on, too. Maybe we could work together again in the future, you know? I would really like that. It's been an awesome journey with you. Hmm. I'm thinking... That... Aha! Uh -huh. We're getting closer! There we go. Okay, yeah, that's the pelvis. There, now it's coming together. Just a little bit of patience. Can't rush these jobs. Otherwise, you might make up an imaginary dinosaur. There. The American Mastodon. Let's do this. Whew, let's go. Oh, crap, we forgot Katie again. That's okay, we'll jump in there and feed her some fish ASAP. I wonder why she's always running out of fish. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Almost there. Man, this is always so tricky. But I think we can do it. We're getting really good at this. Okay. Almost! Almost! Come on, please work. Oh, fudge! Well, we were really close, but we did it! Oh, look at our little girl! Oh, our intern, what should we name her? Our very first baby mastodon! Oh. Oh, do we have everything she needs? Oh, look at that! We're gonna put this right here so the guests can watch her paint. Oh, that's too cool. Let's put a peanut feeder in here for her. Kind of back here. Do we have where she needs to sleep? Yeah. We've got plenty of shelters for her to sleep in. Do we have the kind of food she eats? Mm, we'll add some hay. Let's see. And let's put some hay over here. And otherwise, there's plenty of water, the right type of biome. Alright, there you go, sweetie. Oh, fudge. Okay, we're coming back to that after we take care of Katie, because Katie's sick. She needs attention. I'm sorry, Katie. We got stuck. We got stuck inside the fossil lab. That's not right of me, Katie. I'm going to hire somebody... Oh, Leona just died of old age. Oh, no. And Meerkat5 just died of old age. Katie, are you okay? Okay, yeah, she'll be alright. You! New zookeeper, your sole responsibility is to take care of Katie and the finnick foxes and the meerkats. I think you can, or the finnick foxes and the tortoises. I'm pretty sure you can handle that. I think it's time that we hire a dinosaur rampage team. Okay, you. Hey, let's calm down. Deep breaths. Oh, there we go. There we go. All right, let's go back and admire our new baby mastodon. Oh, apparently there's some poop to clean. Am I standing in it? You, that would have been bad. Oh, beautiful. Look at you guys. Hi, guys. Let's work our way over here. Where's the little girl? Where's our new little girl? What should we name her? Oh, this is so exciting. Hmm. Branches. Where is she? Already she's learning new tricks, playing hide-and-go-seek. Isn't that just so adorable? <gasps> oh, look! She was doing a painting! Oh, she has an artistic bent. That is just fantastic. Oh, that's just fantastic. 
Oh, all right, intern. I'm gonna I'm gonna chill out with our new little baby. Hopefully, get her, you know, a few members of her herd in just a minute. Oh, and then I'll I'll see you back here in a little bit. We're almost there. Almost there, intern. Cliffside Cafe is done. People are actually starting to walk up towards it. We just need to fill this area in with some animals and a playground and some restaurants. Make sure our lonely heart bachelorettes and bachelors have enough to keep the mating going. And then we're done. Wow.